Hello everyone, it's Alexander from City Gazing here. And today I'm in Midtown Manhattan. I'm starting here at the Tudor City Bridge. And you can see United Nations headquarters here. You can come here and take really nice pictures because the view is really good. From this side you can see Long Island city in the very back and you can see East River there. On the other side you will see much more cars alongside with some significant buildings. You can see one Wonder Built and Chrysler building here. My goal for today is to walk across the 42nd Street. I will see how long it will take. I may go to some other street or just will go to the very end of the street. There is some playground right here. And this part is not too busy at the moment, but the, the closer we will be to the Grand Central Terminal, the more people you will see. Today is Thursday, March 7th, and it's 5 p.m. I'll show you this park inside the building. You probably can come inside, but I'm not sure. It just looks very cool. Yeah, it looks like these people were trying to get inside and they were not allowed. Some nice church right here. The Church of the Covenant. You can see a sign that points to Lincoln Tunnel as well as Queen's Midtown Tunnel. So we are somewhere in the middle of Midtown. So you can go to both of these tunnels and go either to Long Island City in Queens or to New Jersey, which is another state. We just crossed Second Avenue. And you can see a lot of people at the bus stop. Everyone's going home. Here is the Pfizer office right here. I haven't prepared any specific facts for today, 
So, sorry about that. But I will comment on what I see. And our family working this thing. Also, I will try to avoid scaffoldings as much as I can. You can see that there is much more people here now because we are very close to the Grand Central Terminal. I like this building. You can see the Chrysler building right there. You probably know this building from the Ghostbusters movie. Or just because that's an iconic one here. Unfortunately, you cannot go up there to see how it looks like from there. It's not open to the public. And right there you can see one wonder build. That's a pretty new building. They have observation deck there. So you can buy a ticket online and go there. Okay. Let me see. I probably want to go to the other side, not to show you scaffolding all the way. I'll show you Chrysler building from another angle.
it is, bro. A lot of people heading to the station. Everyone wants to go home. Look at the bricks in this building. It's beautiful. Here is one of the entrances to the Grand Central Terminal. And this is the bridge you've probably seen in multiple movies and TV series. And here is another entrance. Food cars, as usual. And it's ice cream season already. But to be honest, I think that ice cream season has never ended. Wow, that's noisy. I hate that. Right, I will cross the street here and will turn to the left because I can see scaffolding and I don't want to go there. And we might have a nice view at the Chrysler building. It's a nice view. And the guy is going to fix the camera, I guess, or the lights. Let me stand here for a few seconds. I want to see what he will be doing. Because I can see any marks on the car, so I don't know what he's up to. Uh, it's taking too long. I will be going.
or not? And we are at the 5th Avenue. An interesting fact about the street names. You can see right here it says E 42nd Street, which means East 42nd Street. But as soon as we will close Fifth Avenue, you will see that it will be West 42nd Street. And it's true for all the streets. Fifth Avenue is a divider between East and West streets in New York, in Manhattan. You see it says West 42nd Street now. You can see New York Public Library to my left. It was featured in multiple videos on my channel. So if you want to see it from the other side, you can check some videos about the 5th and 6th avenues. And this is Bryant Park. You've probably seen that multiple times in my videos too. I want to come inside here for a second just to see how they are disassembling <laughs> skate rink. You can see that the territory is closed now and a lot of workers are disassembling every part of it. And in a week or two, we'll have a nice green lawn to chill at. And during the summer, they will be showing some movies there. So it will be a completely different kind of activity to experience there.
these table and chairs, tables and chairs, are here for you to come and grab and have a lunch or just sit there and talk. So it's public. Two towers here, one of them being a Salesforce tower and another is Bank of America tower. Both are huge. We are crossing 6th Avenue. And it's also called Avenue of the Americas. If you want to know why, check out my 6th Avenue video. You can see how dense the crowd is. That's because we are very close to the Times Square. And we'll see even more people here. You can see how bright it is. So we are crossing Broadway now. And if you go that way, you will get to the Times Square. But this time we are not going there. I will continue my stroll further down the 42nd street. You can see Times Square from here.
I was trying to avoid scaffoldings, but it's hard. You can see on the other side of the street, it's a Harry Potter and the Cursed Child Broadway show. So that's my favorite here. I'm going in bus lane so to show you as much as I can. And here's a Madame Tussaud Museum. Here is an AMC movie theater. And here is one of the entrances to the Times Square subway station. You can see how many different stations, no, sorry, not stations, trains it serves. Here is a Port Authority bus terminal. It's a very big bus terminal. You can catch a bus there to, I think, almost anywhere. And here is a cool bike storage. So you can leave your, your bike there if you are going somewhere.
I wonder what's the story behind this bag and a jacket. Another nice church, Holy Cross Church. Cold War Reminders, Fallout Shelter sign. And here is the store where I'm usually getting my shawarma or donor. It's a good one. We will be crossing 9th Avenue now. And we are very close to the Lincoln Tunnel. So we are almost at the end of the 42nd street. I don't know if they're assembling or disassembling it. I hope that they're disassembling. to get cold I need to zip my jacket let's see if I can do that with my one hand Something has happened here. You can see the bridge right there. That's where all buses from the terminal are. Just a few blocks away from Times Square, and it's much more quiet.
you can see a lot of apartment buildings here. The hotel right there called Travel Inn looks very grim. This is NYPD School Safety Division. I always thought that they're just a regular police precinct. And here are some cars, youth response team, school safety. I've never paid attention to that. You can see more and more apartment buildings. And that's the neighborhood called Hell's Kitchen. I'm sorry if the microphone picks up some wind, it's crazy here. You can see how strong the wind is because the lights they're just bouncing from one side to another. All right, I'm not going there because there is a scaffolding. I'll cross the street and we'll go on the other side.
this food truck is probably much much better than the one you can find in Times Square. And this one, if I'm not mistaken, oh, they have a sign here. So that's Yayoi Kusama. And she has very distinctive style of her figures and everything. And I've seen a pumpkin like this before. Looks cool. Another luxury apartments. We are almost at the very end of the 42nd Street. I will not be going to any other street. I'll just show you New Jersey from the other side of 12th Avenue. And that will be it for today. I want to say thanks for watching. Please click subscribe button. And if you want to support me monetarily, I have memberships now. And super thanks. So if you want to just put some dollars in city gazing, click that button. I'll have a link in the description for you. It's a very long light. But we are almost there.
You can see Intrepid in the back. I have a video about that museum too. So check it out. I'm surprised that there is much less wind here at the river bank comparing to the street just a block away. And on the other side of the river you can see New Jersey. And there you can see Hudson Yards skyline. All right, I think that's it for today. Thanks for watching. Please click that subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.